today we're going to be searching this 2013 Ford Police Interceptor sedan. We're going to search it for goodies, weapons, guns, equipment. We're going to try to figure out where it came from, where it's going, and we're going to continue that quest to find that biscuit. This car is so badass. I'm going to show you everything it came with. Stay tuned. Okay, we're going to start from the outside. There is a Whelan Par 46 LED spotlight. Look, it has the Whelan Eon lights. These are actually red and blue. We got some really good Goodyear Eagle RSA tires. This is a 2013, but these are the 2014 hubcaps, which is pretty cool. We have a Satina push bar and uh, look what I did to the bumper cover. You see that? I made it look way more aggressive. I'm going to make a separate video on my second channel on how you can make your car more sporty, more aggressive, under $2. No matter what car you drive, there is white hideaway lights right here and then the other one on the other side. I love the antenna set up here. Very nice. And look how rare the police interceptor emblem is still there. Usually they always tear that off. Okay, let's take a quick look inside. I love this black interior, this thing is so sick. Okay, I'm gonna start from the front and work my way through the back. All right, first of all, I wanna apologize for not posting in a while. My computer has taken a complete crap but I was able to borrow my brother's computer and um, I'm back. Man, just look at this interior. Feels like I'm in a spaceship. <laughs> uh, this bracket holds the computer screen, which was not included, unfortunately, but for some reason they left the keyboard here. And if you pop this up, it opens it up so you could access the radio all right, let's start this baby up. It only has 111,000 miles, only has 1,500 idle hours, which is really great. All right, let's check under the hood. Very clean, very nice. It's clean. It's dirty, but clean. No, no. Okay, right up here, looks like there is a GPS antenna. Now, this is like a portable microphone for the camera system, which is right here. And you can see there's a hole right there where all the wiring goes to. Then there is this really cool camera slash mirror records from the rear and the front it has a lot of cool functions but unfortunately i can't get it to turn on I, uh, there was a lot of clipped wires right over here as you can see right up here there is like a little tactical goggles or something right down here we have a wheeling controller with the microphone with the pa Right down here we have a Motorola Radius M1225. Every once in a while you'll pick up random radio signals. It's a two-way radio. Oh and check this out. How cool is this? I've never seen this in a police car before. This is a straight up paper shredder and it actually works. Alright, let me demonstrate with this ticket I found. Yeah! And right up here we have a Motorola radio speaker. All right, let's check out these visors. Check it out, very nice. Can you believe these cars were made specifically for police by police? Here is some leftover stickers from the previous department that might give us some clues of what department this was. 
All right, let's take a look on this side. This is pretty interesting. Uh, you can stick things right here. Maybe some ammo, magazines. And uh, right over here looks like there's a stream light charger. Hopefully we can find a stream light in here. This is an ID scanner. This scans, see that? And that just sends information to the computer, but there is no computer, so that sucks. But this is still pretty freaking cool. It looks like a uh, calculator, so they can calculate how many years you're gonna do for driving with a suspended license. Oh wait, no, for having your tent too dark. <laughs> NRA, National Rifle Association. I always like to check back there. Oh no, what have I done? But what could is a spare key gonna do back here if you locked out? There you go, just like new. Temperature thing. Let's see if I have the Rona. Crap, man. My fever won't go away. <laughs> I'm just kidding, this ain't right. There's no way I'm not 105, I'd be dead. Carbon rolls and warmers. All right, let's take a look in the back. Look at this. This is freaking sick. Can't get out through here, so I wanna make sure I don't lock myself in here. This goes right here. Very nice. Uh, Wheelan Slim Lighter. I wonder what color this is. Let's put this to the test. Can we find a biscuit this year? You know what they say? You can't win if you don't play. Look at this. And then here's. Is this one on? Okay, check this out, guys. Gun racks. Those are perfect for the trunk. Check that out. Another gun rack. Sick. That's a uh, Wheeling Talon. Dash light. Amber, amber. Sick. Okay, let's uh, cut this up and test it out. These are for jumper cables. Some rope. The Stinger spike system. My other one got burnt up in that fire. Sick. This advice is only for trained law enforcement officers. It's not often you come across these. Let's take a real good look at it. Okay, so you throw it and it expands. When the wheels run it over, this little thing punctures the wheels and gives it a nice guaranteed flat tire. Oh yeah, look, I was able to take one off. Let's put it back. I know you gotta go through like some type of training to use these. I might be able to figure this out. I mean, how hard could it be? <laughs> hey, close enough user accepts liability okay Huh. Look at what we have here. Oh my god. Crack pipe aroni. Hey,
Pak Tiga Puluh Pisara. Ini dia mana jawab? Benar. 